Hello and greetings from Hyderabad, India. I um, just wanted to take a moment to say, first of all, that I apologize that I'm traveling and I'm going to miss this second session of Goa with you. Uh, but thanks again to Jen for her willingness to cover this session for me. And I'm definitely excited to meet all of you in person during the third Goa session. Uh, but I thought it was particularly relevant uh, for, for me to talk with you regarding the diversity experiences you'll be talking about today. Simply because I am actually not too far from the actual place Goa, which is where the name comes from of the program, here in India. So uh, India, to me, has always been a very fascinating place to visit, uh, simply because, specifically with diversity, uh, it's a country literally that seems like there are just thousands of people from different perspectives, languages, cultures, that all kind of interact with each other. Um, and it, it's very much a sense of a live and let live, if that makes sense to you, in the sense that people seem to be able to uh, have very, very different perspectives, backgrounds, religions, uh, and yet and yet seem to be able to be uh, in in each other's presence and, and uh, thrive with each other. So uh, even last night, for example, we arrived to Hyderabad pretty late, um, and uh, right in front of us we saw three women who were wearing burqas from head to toe, uh, who are three Muslim women specifically, uh, next to a, a guy that could have come from California with... Um, uh, blonde hair and dreadlocks. So it's a certain type of place that, that comes from, from a very wide range of people and perspectives. Uh, and I think with regard to diversity, I hope that's your experience uh, in terms of your time at Xavier as well. One of the things that's very important to me uh, with the work that I do with the admissions office is to make sure that we are attracting students who come from many different backgrounds, many different perspectives, in the hopes that you really benefit a lot from, from interacting with people that might be a little bit different than you. And so I think one of the things that I really encourage you to think about today is, is thinking about what you bring to the table. And all of us really do have very unique perspectives to bring. Uh, and it's very important for you to feel comfortable understanding what your own perspective is. Uh, your own perspective as a uh, student from wherever school you attended, from whatever, um, you know, uh, what kind of experiences you've had so far at Xavier, what do you th how do you think of yourself racially, um, social, economically, in terms of your gender, in terms of your sexual preference, all those kind of things. Uh, it's important to have a good sense of that. And I think what you're going to find over the next few years here at Xavier is that that helps to really expand your sense of that identity as well. Uh, and so I hope you find that Xavier so far has been a very welcoming place for you. Um, and I hope that you really benefit from this, this diversity course, this diversity section today. Uh, and again, I'll be looking forward to meeting all of you in person here in a couple weeks. So I hope you have a great class and uh, look forward to meeting all of you soon.